we're going to be dealing with the metabolic rate. All right, so we have two 22-year-old friends, so Isabella and Monica. Now, the girls, okay, have chosen to study, so a particular metabolic rate formula right here, and this is what the formula is. Now, so M is mass in kilograms, H is height in centimeters, and the A, the subscript Y, is the age in years. The S is a constant, and in this case, it's equal to negative 161 calories per day for females. All right, so we have Isabella and Monica. Okay, so as our two girls there. So Isabella has found out that her BMR is 1411.5 calories per day. So that means how many calories she would need in order to basically maintain kind of her main functions of the body. Monica's is a little bit lower. All right, so we're gonna write those down. We have the height for Isabella. We also have the height for Monica. And now based on the information, we want to figure out what the weight is for the girls in kilograms. So we want to be able to find the mass and then round your answer to the one. So let's write down all our given pieces of information here. Given. So of course, you know, we have, I'm going to cheat a little bit here. Let me copy down. So I do have the actual formula. Make it a little bit bigger. Now, what else do they give me? They gave me, so mass is supposed to be in kilograms. I actually do not know the mass. That's what I'm gonna be trying to find. So notice the weight in kilograms. So I'm gonna be looking for the mass. So that's gonna be our unknown. Now, the H, so the height, so I guess, let me maybe write it like this. So this is gonna be H, and then I'll put a little I. This is for Isabella, and Isabella is 1.7 meters. Now notice something interesting, because in the formula, they tell you the formula is in centimeters. So we have to change this. So you have to know your prefixes. So 170, this is gonna be centimeters. And maybe I'll put a, a link, okay, up above for anyone who wants to take a look at the prefixes per se. So that's 170 centimeters. Now the height for Monica, so I'm going to put HM, so capital M, so that is 1.59 meters. So again, I'm going to change this to centimeters. So that's going to be that. Now what else do we have? They, um, we know the ages, so we know the ages. So again, so I'm going to put age, I'll just say A, I know that it says A um, subscript Y, but I'm gonna put A, so that's gonna be the age. And then now the ages, actually they're the same. So I can write here, so they're because they're both 22 years old. So that's going to be, so that's coming from right there in the beginning. All right, so we have the age. Um, we know S, <clears throat> so in this case, our S right here, um, that is given to us in the question. So that's 161 calories per day. All right. So that's what we have there. And let me just highlight it that for you right there. So that's where this is coming from. And then finally, so we have, so let me, so H we have, this we have, this we have. We also have the BMR. So BMR, and now I'm gonna say I, so that's gonna be for Isabella. So for Isabella, it says it was 1411.5, again, so calories per day. And the BMR for Monica, so that's going to be 1232.75. One, two, three, two point seven five calories per day. All right, so that's what we have. So that's a lot of givens, but that's because we have two individuals. All right, and we're going to be trying to find the mass. All right, so 
let me just write down here. So first I'm gonna say Isabella. All right, so let's find the mass for Isabella first. All right, so with that, <clears throat> so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the, let me paste this. So I have that and then I'm gonna fill everything in. So for Isabella, so what do we have? I'm gonna keep it, so this is 1411.5 equals 10 M. We don't know the mass or the weight. So now this is 6.25 multiplied by Isabella's height, which was 170. So that is 170 minus, this is now gonna be five, the age, which is 22. And I'm running out of space here, so I'm gonna shift this a little bit. And then minus 161. So I have pretty much all the information here. So, I mean, I can, so I can do all of this in one step. Okay, so let me do that. I'm gonna swing the calculator over. So I have 6.25 multiplied by 170 minus five times 22 minus 161. All right, so let me do that. So this gives me, 10m plus 791.5. Now, once I have that, so now I can go ahead and solve for m. So the m is right here. So I can bring this over to the other side. So it's gonna be 1411.5 minus 791.5 equals to 10m. And so with that, so I have 1411.5 minus 791.5. So that's equal to that. So this is gonna be 620 equals to 10M. Now dividing both sides by 10. So for that, so notice the tens cancel and actually here, so that's gonna be 62. All right, so we have found Okay, Isabella's mass. So that's gonna be 62 kilograms. All right, so that's the first one. Now we're gonna be repeating exactly the same thing for Monica. So we're gonna take our equation, gonna expand it out. And now I'm gonna be working with Monica's items. So one, two, three, two, seven, five. One, two, three, two point seven, five equals to 10 M plus 6.25. Now her height was 159 from what I remember. Okay, so this is her age and then that's what we have there. All right, so let's double check. Yep, that was her height. So now exactly the same procedure. So I'm gonna do this. So let me do that. So 6.25 multiplied by 159 minus five times 22 minus 161. So here, so what I have is 722.75. So that's 10 M plus that. Let me squeeze this over. So 1232.75. Again, I'm gonna bring this over to the other side. So I'm gonna have 1232.75 minus 722.75 is equal to 10 M. All right, so that would have been next. Now subtracting the two, so 1232.75 minus 722.75, that's 510. Now dividing both by 10 again, and that's gonna give me my answer. So notice, so this is gonna be 51 kilograms. So that's gonna be the mass, all right? So for Monica. So those are the two girls and we have found their weight, all right? Okay, so thanks for watching. See you in a future video.